picked up this wire stripper and did this other twisting tool from Amazon for about $20 Canadian. And see what we get here. We get the stripper and we get the... This is supposed to be a twisting tool here. So we'll take a look at these today. Take a look at the wire stripper here. 2.5 square. That will fit 14, I believe. There's three different ones you can buy. 2.5, 4, and 6. I just wanted to try the one. And... Uh, should be working the number 14 wire. This product can be installed, electric drills, charging your electric drills, electric wrenches, etc. The electric wire stripper and electric tools can strip the insulation layer off the wires, can effectively improve efficiency, quality of workers. And here's some other thing. Please wear safety helmets, gloves, etc. Before you use, please read the manual carefully. So it's got some no, uh, notes here. So they want the, they want the wire round, not uh, oblong here and the, the wire to be straight they don't want it curved they won't work and then when you're using your drill they want it straight on there so a couple of notes here it's in a kind of a plastic package in here it's all it's grooved here yeah so it's well so you get instructions here Product review here. Read that after. You get the. This is very, very sharp here. Inside here, that's what's going to cut the wires inside there. So that blade. Whoa. And this is uh, to change the blade here. Little Allen wrench to change the blade. That'll loosen that screw and change the blade. And we'll take a look at this wire stripper today. 2.5 and here's the blade a very sharp blade here and this is the end of it where you put your wire into it to strip your sheathing off the wiring and this does come apart here it's threaded in here let's take it apart to show you now it can be adjusted so when you're cutting your wire uh, you can pull the sleeve back and just adjust your wire Length of how much wire you want to cut off, how uh, much sheathing you want to cut off your wiring here. Little notches in there. There's no numbers on here, so you just have to trial and error here. That'll stretch out quite a bit here. That'll strip quite a bit of wire here. And just pull this sleeve back to put all the way in here. Quarter inch shank here. So we'll try it out, see what, how it works here. So basically, they're just saying that the uh, when you're using this wire stripper, that make sure that the wire is straight into the uh, the tool itself and uh, the the very sharp blade inside there. So we'll take a look at this uh, tool here to cut wires. This is a quarter inch shank. Put that inside your drill here. This is the smallest setting, so make sure your wire is uh, nice and straight here. It does a nice job. And then you can adjust the length here by pulling up in the sleeve and going even go as far as you want. And there's notches, like I said, there's notches on here. Make sure your wire's straight. There you go. That's a nice job. Go just wherever you want here. You bring it down, it gets to the notch. And I was going to try the number 12 two wire here. See what cuts it. That's a real nice job. This is number 14 gauge strand of wire. See if it works or not. Does a nice job. The wire twister with a quarter inch shank will fit in your drill. And then it has grooves in it like this. And we use the red one here. And it kind of catches the perfect for the red one here. And we'll put uh, three wires together here and see how it works. That's a nice job. That's just three wires. Twist them together. Twist all the wires together. Now let's try using two different, see the white wires here, and using the yellow one. Try the yellow one here. Use, use this for two wires here. And put the two connectors in here. Let's 
does a nice job. So I'll use this yellow one. There's no wings on it. Put it inside here. See what kind of a job it'll do here. Works. Big blue ones won't fit in here. They're just too uh, loose here. This little wire twister works fairly well. The reason I wanted to buy this one is for 14 2 wire and try it on 12 2 wire and even strata wire. So this is the 2.5. It comes in 2.5, 4, and 6. Uh, it has the, the blade in it with the Allen wrench. It doesn't have extra blades. The thing I like this, you can adjust it by using pulling up the sleeve and adjust the length you want. I always have trouble getting the, the correct length when I'm looping these wires. Once you set this, it'll be the correct length all the time. Very nice feature. It just make sure you get it straight in there and it works flawlessly. There's a piece of the uh, plastic was on the copper wire here. I'll leave a link below where you can get it on Amazon. So please subscribe to my channel. It uh, doesn't cost you a thing. It really helps my channel. And ring that bell to be notified next time I upload a video. I'd like to thank all my subscribers. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video. Have a great one, people.